Hey guys, Forrester Story here. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to factory reset and delete everything on your iPad Pro first generation on the latest version of it. So let's get started. Now, the process has changed from previous version of it. So if you're an older iPad uh, version of the iPad Pro, it's going to be different, but this is on the latest version of it. So in order to factory reset and delete everything first thing of course you want to do before you even consider is backing it up either back up to your iCloud account if you have iCloud on signed on or you can back it up to your computer using iTunes but you want to back it up and the reason why it is after you do a factory reset it's going to delete everything and you will not be able to get it back so it's really really important that you back it up if you want to restore it on another iPad like if you get a new iPad or you want to restore the content back again. So once that's cleared out of the way, it's time to reset or factory reset it. First thing is you go into your settings, and then you go to general, and then scroll down here where it says transfer reset iPad, click on that, and then there's an option to erase all content and setting. We click on that. Now once you click on that, you're going to be prompted to enter your passcode for your iPad if you have one set up. It's going to also ask for your Apple ID password if you have an Apple ID password on. So make sure you enter that or sign out of your Apple account uh, before going through the process or it will ask for your Apple ID again once you try to set it up. So as you can see, it's going to erase this iPad. So we can hit continue and it's going to want us to confirm that we really want to do that. And if we do, we simply click on erase iPad. And after that, the race process will begin. Now, generally, this can take a couple of minutes, sometimes up to five to 10 minutes, depending on how much content you have there that it has to delete. You want to uh, go through this whole process to up to the point where you see the screen says hello, uh, which means it's been completely or successfully factory reset. And during this process, the other thing I want to make sure that you do have is it's charged up. So if you have iPad that's dying, you want to make sure it's charged up at least 50% or more or connected to a charger during this process because you don't want it to die during the process because that will kind of stop the deletion process. So make sure you see it all the way through. It will load, flash the Apple logo a few times. It's completely fine. This menu will pop up with this loading bar a few times as well. And that's completely fine as well. It's just doing its thing. You don't have to worry about any of that. Just let it go through the process of just deleting everything like it should. And we're going to show you how long this takes. This iPad didn't have much content, so it should go pretty quick. But if you have an iPad with a uh, lot hundreds of uh, gigs of data it will take a little bit a while just because it has to delete everything and this method is the same exact method that uh, will happen whenever you get a new iPad uh, so this is something you want to do if you're trading it in selling it or uh, giving it away whatever it is the next person can just set it up themselves and use it like a fresh new iPad because of course it will remove all of your information from photos videos apps whatever you had They'll just have to um, set it up with their account and then download apps and do the same exact thing like if they uh, brought a new iPad from the store. So as you can see here, it's still going through the process. So we're going to wait it out till it goes through just so you can see the whole process. and it's still going which is fine we just want to show you in real time how long it takes but if you want if you want to go fast forward a little bit you can you should see basically the hello screen is what we're looking to show you so you have an idea what it looks like when it's successfully factory reset and i believe it should hopefully show it right after the screen yep and it does and as you can see here hello when you get this hello that means it's ready to go and you can click on the home button swipe up and it should ask you to select a language because it's looking for you to set it up again like brand new and i hope this video was helpful if so please consider hitting the like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks for your ipad and other ios devices see you guys and next time